Well, hi folks, it's Stephen Bundy from LJ Hooker at Dixon again, back in Ainsley with my good mate, Andrew Brown. And we're on Ebden Street this time. Beautiful time of the evening. It's high summer, it's really warm. We've got Mount Ainsley just there. And of course, Braddon and the city just over our shoulders. The cottage was built in 1944. It's a classic Ainsley red brick, double brick with a twist. It's been extended, beautifully renovated and it's impeccably presented. Andrew? Yeah, Stephen, of course, Ainsley's been really popular amongst Inner North buyers for a couple of years now, and really easy to see why. The location that you've spoken about, nice and close to the city, but what about the block size as well, Stephen? 900 square metres, pretty hard to find. In excess of 900. But anyway, that's enough from us. Let's go and have a look at the house, eh? After you. The current owner's been here since 1993 and she's loved living here, both the home and the location. And the extensions under her careful guidance have added greater utility and aesthetic. One of her favourite things is this beautiful big bedroom with the dressing room, or as she calls it, her sanctuary, which comes directly off it. The home currently boasts four bedrooms, two beautiful bathrooms, and of course, the sanctuary or this peaceful retreat. For peace of mind, the house has crimp safe doors all the way around and for added livability, there's double glazed windows to the east and comfort glass to the west. The kitchen's large and beautifully appointed. And even though it was renovated back in 2007, you would never guess it because it's held its age perfectly. Top line appliances and this wonderful extra thick black granite bench all adds up to be a delight for any chef. And what better place to finish up than this wonderful covered hardwood deck. The northern sun comes streaming in here in winter. We're westerly to the rear, but there's awnings that drop down to keep the hot summer sun away. The barbie's just over there, so wonderful place to finish the day. A cool drink in hand, perhaps a barbecue, some friends over, a way to unwind and relax in your own private haven. What do you think, Andrew? Yes, I couldn't agree more, Stephen. What a beautiful place it is out here on the deck. We're really looking forward to seeing our buyers come through the next open home. We'll see you then. Cheerio.